Hi, my name is Ruman Khan and in this video I'll be showing how to add IP blacklist policy in MuleSoft API Manager. I'm currently logged in into API Manager and I already have an API Manager setup which is configured to point to this endpoint. Currently there is no restriction trying to browse to this particular endpoint. And as you see, browsing to this endpoint will return a success status message. Now let's go back and click on policies, and apply new policy. Let's select IP blacklist and configure policy. So this particular policy has two fields, IP expression and a blacklist, which has the IP address. So for IP expression, if you are like me sitting behind an ISP, then your actual public IP address will be exposed via X forwarded for header. And since I'm recording this behind an ISP, I'll just copy this particular expression and add it here. In order to find the public IP, you can visit what is my public IP.com and copy your IP address and paste it here and click on add, apply. So once this policy is applied, browsing to this URL should now give me an error. Let's refresh. Refreshing this URL gives me invalid IP with a description indicating IP address is invalid since I have blacklisted my own IP address. Coming back to the API manager, let's disable this particular policy now and quickly see the opposite of blacklist, which is IP whitelist. And as you see, IP whitelist is exactly the same as the IP blacklist. It has the same IP expression and whitelist. So you can provide your IP address and the IP expression, which can be used to extract the IP address out of the incoming request. So IP whitelist policy can whitelist particular IPs for your API, while IP blacklist policy will blacklist particular policies in your API. Hope this video was helpful. Thank you.